So we have 12 of these Johnsonville original sausage patties. I am then going to grab some eggs, crack one in there. I'm using nine eggs because we have 12 in there. And we're just gonna grab a whisk. Oh, there's a shell, got it. Grab a whisk, whisk that up really, really fast. This is a quick and easy recipe to do for breakfast for families of four, just you and your spouse. Perfect, that looks good. Awesome, so as soon as that's done, as soon as that's done, pour this right on top. Here we go. Mm. You wanna fill it up pretty much to the edge. Make sure your pan is nice and greased. All right, that one's good right there. Now we take a little bit of diced yellow onions, pour right on top. Get it right there in the egg. Mm, I love onions. Onions just, they, they enlighten the dish. You know, they bring, they uplift all the flavor. It's a nice, it has a nice subtle taste to it, especially when it's cooked within that egg. So after we do this, we're gonna go instantly right into our roasted red bell peppers. Ooh, See that? Yum. I like the, the I like it when it's fermented in the juice because then it's just it has way more flavor. So you want to put a dollop right here, on in in each one. You can do whatever ingredients you want in this. You can you can do green bell peppers, freshly cut bell peppers. You could do jalapenos. Sweet, do this right here and this right here. Perfect. Ooh. Now to complement everything, I like to use dehydrated chives. This just adds that pop of color. It has a nice crunch on the top. You just kind of keep going. I'm, I'm going super fast for you guys, but you guys can take your time. You can make this look elegant, a little bit more elegant, but I like the way that looks. Looks delicious. All right, we're gonna use some black pepper here. And you know, just, just a little bit, just enough to, just enough to season it. There we go. You can do exactly what you did. We're gonna pop these out so it doesn't matter how messy the pan is. There you go. And of course, we need to season it with some salt as well. So just a little bit right there. There you go, and you do the same thing. We're almost done here. We have pretty much one, we have one final ingredient and we're gonna throw these bad boys in the oven, all right? Mm. And I like it a little spicy. You can do whatever cheese you want, but I'm gonna use some pepper jack. I love pepper jack. Pepper jack is so amazing. So I'm gonna do a little dollop right there. I want it to melt oh. right on top. It's okay if it overflows a little bit. That's just gonna be some liquid goodness right See, there. Yeah, put a little on that one. Yeah, there you go. Look at that. Perfect. We're almost done here. This is the final ingredient. We're gonna throw this in the oven right after we're done here. Hang tight. We're gonna do this right now. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Perfect. How's that look? That so looks good, but that one, I think we need to it's clean okay. out. It's okay, it's okay. We got it right here. So you just, this happens, it's okay. Can't, can't win them all. That's just the black sheep of the family. There we go, we're gonna put this in the oven. We got 400 for 20 minutes. All right, these are all done. Look at this. Oh. Let's pop one of these out. Okay. See, so you, you can tell by it being pushed right there. All right, let's get this out. Oh, I can't wait to see that sausage. Oh, oh yeah. You see that? Perfect little egg bite. Yeah. Okay, see that? Mm. All right. And I love, I found this sriracha. It's a Texas Ooh. style. And I'm just gonna drizzle it. Oh yeah, you like it spicy. Yeah, you could do it how you want. But let's cut into this. Let's see how it looks. <gasps> Look at that. It's perfect. It looks amazing. Get some of that sriracha there. Okay. It's so easy to pick up. You see that? Yep. Blow on it because it's super hot. It was at 400. Okay, here we go. Is it good? Oh my God. It's so good. Mm. Hot, but good. I want one. 